Deep Links blog by Catherine Trendacosta, May 16, 2018 The Senate has voted to restore the 2015 Open Internet Order and reject the FCC's attempt to gut net neutrality. This is a great first step but now the fight moves to the House of Representatives. Final Senate vote was 52 to 47 in favor. That puts a bear. Deep Links blog by Catherine Trendacosta, May 9, 2018 In December, the FCC voted to end the 2015 Open Internet Order, which prevented Internet Service Providers ISPs, like at A simple majority vote in Congress can keep the FCC's decision from going into effect. From now until the Senate votes, F. Deep Links blog by Ernesto Falcon, May 4, 2018 In their effort to prevent states from protecting a free and open Internet, a small handful of massive and extraordinarily profitably Internet service providers ISPs, are telling state legislatures that network neutrality would hinder their ability to raise revenues to pay for upgrades and thus force them to charge consumers. Links blog by Ernesto Falcon, April 16, 2018 SB 822, Senator Scott Wiener's net neutrality bill, is currently pending in the California legislature. It's a bill that prioritizes consumers over large ISPs, creating strong net neutrality protections. Unsurprisingly, at Deep Links blog by Catherine Trendacosta, April 16, 2018 8 out of 10 Americans support net neutrality, which makes opposing it a bad look for both politicians and corporate PR. So everyone says something along the lines of being in favor of net neutrality or an Internet Bill of Rights. Every time, however, giant Internet service providers, ISPs, Deep Links blog by Ernesto Falcon, April 13, 2018 Deep Links blog by Catherine Trendacosta, April 12, 2018 Deep Links blog by Ernesto Falcon, April 3, 2018 In response to the rollback of federal network neutrality protections, this year more than 20 states have taken up the mantle of protector of a free and open Internet. Washington has already passed a law in Oregon's waits to be enacted. Not to be outdone, California has three bills pending. Links blog by Aaron Ju, March 6, 2018 Domain Name Registrar Name Cheap has relaunched Move Your Domain Day, encouraging customers to raise money for online freedom with every domain move. Name Cheap will donate up to $1.50 per domain transfer to the Electronic Frontier Foundation when customers switch to their service on March 6. With this year's promotion, Deep Links blog by Catherine Trendacosta, February 27, 2018 Today, F is participating in a National Day of Action to push Congress to preserve the net neutrality rules the FCC repealed in December. With a simple majority, Congress can use the Congressional Review Act CRA, to overturn the FCC's new rule. We're asking for members of the House and